Hi, Hope. What's up, Hope? Hey, Saints, what's up? It's Sister with a Testimony and Hope on a Star. Hey, pretty baby. What's up, pretty girl? Yep, she's looking for something to eat. Um, yeah, she loves to go out, but, um, if she's out there and there's no provision, she's just kind of out there in the lot all by herself, and she's like, man, look at that grass. Wow, look at that grass just outside the fence. Saints, have y'all ever thought about that? How the grass is always greener on the other side of the fence? I mean, look at Hope. She's like, if I could just get out there and get to the grass, yeah, I'd be a one happy camper because there's no grass in here. Saints, I think we've all done that. Look at that grass out there. She's like, if I could just get out there to that grass, you know, we're sitting there in the lot and uh, trying to find a little scrape of grass. Think about that. Yeah. Kind of back and forth. Back and forth, back and forth. How many people do you know are straddling the fence? Well, Hope don't have no choice. She's got to either be inside the gate or outside the gate. Inside the lot, inside the fence, outside. Uh, but wow, look at that green grass. Woo, look at that green grass. It's just right there. And, and it's like, oh, if I could just get my nose through that fence far enough over there, I could have that grass. I'll bet you she's got her mind on that grass. Saints, what have y'all got your mind on today? The Bible is very simple if you think about it. Yeah, tell them, tell them, Hope. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Wow, what a promise, saints. So even though Hope is inside her little corral, and she's sniffing around on the bare dirt, and she can see that luscious green grass over there, Hope knows that I'm going to feed her. Hi, Hope. Are you hungry, baby? She knows that I am going to feed her. I'm going to give her water. I'm going to care for her. She knows because I'm the one that feeds her. When she sees me coming, she's like, Hey, Mom. She, she speaks to me. She acknowledges me, saints. Why is she acknowledging me? Because first and foremost, she belongs to me. She's one of my pets. She's one of my peeps. Whatever you want to call it. I'm responsible for her, saints. And the Lord is responsible for you. In Psalm 23, a Psalm of David, he starts it out, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Hope doesn't have a worry. She doesn't have a care in the world. She just hang out in her little lot, knowing feeding time's coming. And if I miss feeding time, she lets me know about it. Saints, the Lord will lead you. He will guide you. He will instruct you in the path to go. It doesn't matter where you're at. He is the one that restores you. He is the one that restores your soul. For his own sake, he will lead you in the paths of righteousness. I've got to go out there. I've actually got to put a halter on her, put a lead rope on her, and lead her where she needs to go. But the Lord should be able to just speak to you and lead you down the paths of righteousness because you're seeking Him. And even though you get in a tight spot, saints, 
even though you're walking, it seems, in the valley of the shadow of death and everybody's against you, everybody's coming against you, all of hell is breaking loose around you, so you think, the Lord has already gone ahead of you and made a crooked path straight. You don't have to fear any evil because the Lord promises you right here in Psalm 23, I will fear no evil for thou art with me. He says, you are with me. I know you're with me, Lord. And the Lord is telling you, I'm with you. My rod and staff comforts you. King David is saying, you know what? I know you've put me in this place. You've prepared a table before me. My enemies are all around me. I'm going to sit here in peace because you've anointed my head with oil. You have anointed my head with oil and my cup runs over. Saints, let your cup run over. This mare knows she's safe. She knows she's got food coming. She always has water before her. And let me tell you what. When the Lord says, Surely goodness and mercy will follow you all the days of your life. You're going to dwell in the house of the Lord forever. That's a promise. So just like hope on a star has a promise of her next meal. And she can walk around in her little lot. Her little bare lot. And she's just looking at that grass all day long. Saints, the grass is not always greener on the other side of the fence. You might be right in the right place that you need to be in. You might definitely be in a sand lot with grass on the other side of that fence. But saints, I'm pretty sure, according to the word of God, he's got you. He's got this. And you can rely on him to supply your needs. You can rely on him to lead you down the paths of righteousness. You can rely on the Lord to take care of you. Let the Lord lead you and guide you, saints, and be thankful in the place that you're at. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He restoreth my soul. Yay. Hallelujah. Saints, God bless you today. Be peaceful and happy like hope on a star. No matter what circumstance you're in, even if the grass looks greener on the other side of the fence, just settle in, settle down, and know that the Lord will provide. He will lead you. He will guide you. He will never forsake you. And you will have goodness and mercy following behind you all the days of your life. And you will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. She's like, oh, mom, I'm getting really sleepy. The sun feels so good. Yes, she's peaceful. I speak peace to you, saints. I speak peace to you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Peace that surpasses all understanding. Hope you enjoy the sunshine. God bless you. It's hope on a star. And sister with a testimony.